Welcome to Caseway Quick Fits. This Quick Fit provides an overview of the Time Equation Editor. The Equation Editor is a tool to build filter equations for time documents. You can build simple or complex equations using the SQL tables listed for the document. As an example, we will make a filter for the Work in Process Detail Report. Open the WIP report from the Document Manager. To access the Equation Editor, open the Document Properties of the document by right-clicking on the document and select Properties. Click on the Equation Editor button, found on the filter line. The dialog guides you to build the equation. Each expression in the equation is built in the upper half of the screen and displayed in the filter pane once it is complete. To build an expression, you need to select a table, a field, a comparison, and evaluate where applicable. We will filter the WIP report on work code 130 and staff member Henry Strauss. From the table list, select work code. From the field list, select number. From comparison list, select is equal to. And from the value list, you select 130. Notice when you select this, the expression appears in the lower filter pane. To add the new expression to the equation to filter on staff equal to Henry Strauss, highlight a new line in the expression pane and click the AND button. From the table list, select employees. From the field list, select last name. From the comparison list, select is equal to. And from the value list, select Strauss. Notice that the updated filter now appears in the lower filter pane. For best practices, click on the Validate button. Validation is successful, indicates the filter is built correctly. Click on the OK button to close the editor. The filter appears in the Document Properties. It is saved in the Document Manager so that each time the document is run, the filter will be applied to the document. Click OK on the Document Properties and you will see the report is now filtered on Work Code 130 and staff member Henry Strauss. Additional functionality on the Equation Editor allows you to use functions in the filter to create a more advanced expression. To show this, we will edit the current filter by going back in the Equation Editor. Let's filter the report on Work Codes, which begin with the letter E for Expenses. First delete the expression for the last name equal to Strauss by highlighting the expression line and clicking on the Delete button. You will now edit the existing expression by highlighting the expression. Delete 130 in the value cell and type in E. The expression now says work code number is equal to E, which will not give us the correct filter. What we need to do is filter on the first letter of the work code. Click on the expression and the function button and a list of functions which are available for the equation editor are listed. Select left by double clicking. The function is added left to the work code number and needs to know how many characters you are filtering on. Put the number 1 in the space before the last bracket. Click on Check Syntax. You will see if the function is correct. Click OK to close the function dialog. You will see the expression is equal to E. Close the properties and the report now filters on the expense work codes. One last area for the Equation Editor is multiple filters. Some reports require multiple filters on separate tables to filter the data properly. Integrated WIP and Accounts Receivable reports are an example of this. Open the Integrated WIP and Accounts Receivable Summary Report and open the Document Properties. When looking at the Equation Editor, you will see the Multiple Filters Lookup list. If you want to filter on a project for both the WIP and the Accounts Receivable, you need to use multiple filters. In our example, we will filter the report on project equal to odd 2009. Select WIP on the multiple filters, project from the table list, number from the field list, equal to from the comparison list and odd 2009 from the value list. Then select Accounts Receivable on the multiple filters, project from the table list, number from the field list, equal to from the comparison list and odd 2009 from the value list. 
you will see the filters being created in the bottom pane. Validate the expressions, close the equation editor, and the document properties and you will see the filtering on the project report. This covers the equation editor and how to filter your documents. Thank you for watching. Caseware QuickVids.